all. This is a medical video lecture pediatrics and in this video I'm gonna talk about the definite or specific treatment of large VSD. VSD is a really very important topic for uh, pediatrics okay the pediatrics is really very important you should know each and everything from etiology genetics till to the management because this is very commonest congenital heart disease in children so let's talk about the treatment of a large sized VSDs the large size VSDs they close very rarely so you have to manipulate we have to treat it either by medically and then surgically okay since the patient is at risk of developing congestive cardiac failure and cachexia in about three to six months so surgery should be carried out by three to six months of age right and even it can be carried out earlier to prevent these complications that is CCF that is congestive cardiac failure okay first initially you should start with the medical management and as uh, as what you could uh, do in the moderate type of uh, or medium sized um, VST okay like controlling CCF prevent pulmonary hypertension prevent respiratory infections prevent to give prophylaxis for infective endocarditis right so these are the things that you do in the moderate VST right so what are the surgical the mode of surgical closure in these patients so we have surgery one is open surgery repair open surgical repair open surgical repair then we have catheter occlusion catheter occlusion and then we have another one pulmonary artery binding pulmonary artery banding okay the in open surgical repair is a, one of the most favored method okay the patch closure of VSD through right ventriculotomy or transatrial approach is done okay is a patch closure you can remember patch closure okay of VSD through right ventriculotomy you enter through right ventriculotomy or transatrial approach whatever is convenient for a surgeon now the catheter occlusion in the catheter occlusion okay it can be what you call alternative method in case of muscular or perimembranous VSDs okay catheter device have two what you call opposing disc which are inserted via catheterization to occlude the defect that's what known as the catheter occlusion okay in the pulmonary artery banding it is a palliative procedure used in the patients where surgical closure is not possible for example swiss cheese vsd where there is a multiple vsds right multiple vsds or even if there is a complicated cases then it is done okay by what happens by decreasing the left to right shunt development of ccf is delayed so the pulmonary artery banding is done so these are the surgical options that you can talk about during your clinical examination in pediatrics okay guys so thank you so much for watching this video take care